my goodness. It's really happening. That's right. What's up? All right. What is going on, everybody? How are y'all doing? Before we get started with this video, thumbs up. Give the video a like. We have some dope gaming news items. But the first one, the PlayStation 5 leaks of the early... June PlayStation 5 reveal looks like they were all true bro Sony has just updated the official PlayStation 5 website now <laughs> for a reference point the last time Sony's official PlayStation 5 page was updated was right before the debacle that was that Mark Cerny presentation. Don't get me wrong. Mark Cerny, brilliant guy. Great guy. But it was just a wrong, it was a, just wrong to have that as the first time we get news for a PlayStation 5. You got to get us hype, bro. Not a boring tech speech. I get it was for GDC, but still, should have planned that better, Sony. But the last time the page was updated was for the first uh, announcements, first tech information for the PlayStation 5. And it's just been updated again which means something big is about to happen in the playstation universe where there's smoke there's fire oh we found the fire boys and girls all right so this is what this website has been updated to playstation 5 is coming launches Holiday 2020, <laughs> no delay, console will be holiday 2020, probably going to be in limited quantities, but this is what it says, first, lightning speed, harness the power of a custom CPU, GPU, and SSD with, an, with integrated I.O. that rewrites the rules of what a PlayStation console can do, so first, lightning speed. Second, stunning games. Marvel. <laughs> Marvel. Is that a hint? A clue for the next Spider-Man? Spider-Man. Spider-Man. <laughs> hey, um, right now I'm playing through Horizon Zero Dawn. Game is amazing. The next game I'm going to be playing is Spider-Man before Last of Us 2 comes out. Getting through that backlog for this gen, bro. So, um, it says Marvel. At incredible graphics and experience new PlayStation 5 features. One feature. This one feature, great controller. But one feature this controller is lacking. Motion gyro controls. The PlayStation 4 has it. The PlayStation 5, it looks like the dual sensor is also going to have it. Have that as an option for aiming in your shooters, Sony, just as an option. If dudes don't like motion aiming, that's fine, don't use it. But have it as an option would be lit. Nintendo does it, man. They use that motion aiming. It's in Fortnite. Come on, bruh. It's in other games too, and in Splatoon, of course. So Marvel and Incredible Gap and Spears New Play. That's the biggest thing right here, the stunning games. We wanna see games. I wanna see games from both Microsoft and PlayStation 5. That's what's going to sway me the most. Who has the better games? And finally, breathtaking immersion. Discover a deeper gaming experience with support for haptic feedback, adaptive triggers, and 3D audio technology. And you can sign up for PlayStation 5 news. And so, they've updated their website, which means within a matter of days where it's no longer weeks boys and girls it's now a matter of days before we get the um some big news for
Thrawn, the PlayStation 5. But not to be outdone, Microsoft counters again. Microsoft been trying to counter this whole um, advertising spill leading up to the consoles, reveal launches, etc. Xbox has updated and opened a pre-order. Um, should I chat? No, no, I can't. Y'all don't see that. Um, Microsoft has up, updated or created a pre-order page for the Xbox Series X. And it's the new Xbox Series X fastest, most powerful. And so, uh, you this isn't the actual pre-order page. It's a pre-pre-order page. <laughs> Xbox is funny. You, you can um, sign up for an email to be emailed when more information is available with the Xbox Series X. And of course, they highlight the 12. 12 greater than 10. They give you nothing. Um, and so, um, they updated their page to um, be notified when pre-orders go live. So, things are really, really heating up in the gaming sphere. Next gen should be lit, man. I just want to see the games. I just want to see those games. All right. Next news item. We fi we might have the release year for the next GTA game. GTA 6. According to a recent Take-Two SEC filing, it lets us know more than likely the year GTA 6 will be launching. According to the recent filing, Take-Two expects to spend $89 million on marketing during the 12-month period ending March 31st, 2024. So, for the year of 2023, ending at early 2024, 2K expects to double their marketing spending every time they do that they're launching a huge game it could be red another red dead but since red dead we just got red dead 2 it's time for gta now and so because of such a high increase a sharp spike in marketing spending many are speculating 2023 will be when we're getting the next GTA game. GTA lit, bro. I beat, when the game first launched this gen, I actually beat it on my PlayStation 4. Who'd have thought? Um, dope, dope, dope game. Can't wait to see uh, what GTA 6 is going to be all about. So expect 2023 for major, for GTA 6 to more than likely launch and a crazy marketing spending hey they're spending 89 million but that, this game makes billions bro um, this game just continues to sell year after year after year and the last news item for this video Fortnite looks like we're going to know when chapter 3 ends um, this is coming from GameSpot.com season 2 of Fortnite chapter 2 is originally scheduled to, to end April 30th but a few weeks prior, prior, Epic Games has announced an extension. June 4th will be the new ending date for Season 2. So, Fortnite ends on June 4th. That's the same date as the rumored PlayStation 5 reveal, bro. Is Fortnite and Sony planning something? But Season 3 is now when the expected date is June 4th. June 4th is the expected date. For when season three was start launching Fortnite, and I'm gonna hop on Fortnite sometime today, bro. I haven't, I'm not today, but this week. I haven't been on Fortnite, man. I haven't, bro. I'm gonna play some Apex Legends tonight with the sponsors, bro. And then I don't know what I'm gonna do after. All right, dudes. What do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video? Sound off in the comment section below. I wanna know. But before you go, bro. Click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming, bro. We out, boy. Deuces. You still watching this video? 
That means you like me. You really like me. I got to pick you up. That's right. I'm giving away a $60 digital code every month for your platform of choice. Xbox, Nintendo, or PlayStation. Two ways to enter. One, make sure you're subscribed to this fire right here on YouTube. Two, follow me on Twitter at Obi-Wan Plays. And that's it. You're in for the giveaway. But wait, there's more. Do you want to join an awesome gaming Discord with prizes and tournaments? Do you want to get on my friend list and game with your boy? Become a sponsor. Three ways to join. One, subscribe on Twitch. If you have Twitch Prime, you can do it for free. Two, click the join button right here on YouTube and become a member. And the third way to join, patreon.com backslash Obi-Wan Plays. You'll thank me later. Also, check out the swag, bro. Links are in the description. I'll see you later. Deuces.